Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Doggy Butt Trains channel and Happy New Year! Today, this is a chessboard, of course, you know this is not what it's about. We are, me and Dad are just playing chess, so enough of that. I'm going to show, today I'm going to show you my train room 2.0. Now it's in the train room, of course, because it's a train room. So this is all the stuff. Here is a bed. Little fountain, graveyard there, the train tracks, which I'm setting up. I set it up for a surprise locomotive that's gonna be reviewed in the next video. So here's the whole area. If you come over here, you'll notice something really nuts and heat in this part here. There's like a bunch of zombies in there. There's a zombie there, zombie there, zombies there, guy that got bit. There's all the nice stuff here. There's the tent in. And here's a really cool part. Now here's like the winter Hogwarts village. There's Van, Santa. This is the only action part. Red guys, orange guys, Star Wars guy, something from Batman or something maybe. Look, these are all like guards and stuff in case zombies come. There's Hogwarts, Clock Tower, that, that, that. There's even two dogs in this room if you want. If you like, guys, if you like dogs, you should look inside here. Because there's two dogs right there. That and that. And there's even an angel on the tree if you haven't noticed. Right there, an angel on the tree. And if you look at it from the right angle, it looks like it has wings. If you look at it right, it looks like it has wings. Feathered wings. And here's my zombie tap diner. I'm not gonna show you the insides. All you're gonna see is the beginning. If you probably saw it at the front, right here, it says, it said, go on. Like around here, okay. it's diner, but I took down the N, so now it's, it looks like it says dire. Oh. There's blood reeking out of the door, that, that. There's even a severed head. And look at the giant Hulk zombie there. And then there's the guys, two guys, like, trying to kill it. That SWAT guy there really looks like he's going to meet his doom. He's bending over, tearing down that part. Which this guy? Is the scary part. Which That's guy? The There's a SWAT guy. Here, the guy there, and that's like right there. He has a gun, but it's bent back there, and it's like kind of the zombie. It's this giant zombie that's pounding. There. Who's the guy that's getting? Who's the guy? In Him. Black? Him. He's the SWAT guy, and that's the zombie. Oh down. yeah. Like banging there. It looks like he's in. But luckily, this guy here, with like the Boba Fett looking helmet, helmet right here, mm -hmm. is shooting at him. So maybe if he hits him in the right spot, he'll die. The robot will die. The zombie will die. And here are just some centaurs and a mermaid. This is a fountain I'm going to show you. Okay. For only a few seconds. Oh. Let it regain flow. So that's what the fountain looks like. There's my haunted house. It's really cool with the ghosts. Spider webs, even a dead body in there with a boarded cage, giant spider, skeleton parts, boiled, bur brewing bones. Did you notice this over here? How scary all the tombs are? These are mini figures I got for Christmas. Gates. And if you look here in the gates, open them for you, it looks like Hogwarts Castle there. So I'm guess I'm saying these gates connect Hogwarts or connected to that. And these are like battle droids I'm using, excuse me, as monsters. This is a skeleton part from a tomb. And this looks like something evil was buried here, definitely. In the sarcophagus I made for a mummy. This looks there this looks more graveyard cemetery-ish, more cemetery looking than this and this and this and that. This is probably I think this is almost one of my favorite ones. That I made really quickly. Then there's that. Then there's just all these random stuff here. And there is the messy table. With a zombie apocalypse lab right there. All 
all the zombies. School and stuff, and there's a bit of cool Lego things and other things that aren't exactly Legos. Mm. Here's the inside of the Hogwarts castle. And then there, here, is a really cool guy. Sam the Fighter. He's a hero. Here's the zombie park. Zombie here comes somebody. Denver! And there's my rabbit Hudson over there. He's cute. I actually smell him a lot. Look at all these. It's a guy who got eaten and a crocodile getting eaten by that guy. That, 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 that's so many zombies. There's... It doesn't it look crazy, the turban. A waterfall, another waterfall. That is a central park. Well, central parks, some central parks have waterfalls. Then there's these buildings, that, that. And there's some clone troopers. And if you notice... In here, if you look here, you might see it better. If you then that actually, I'll open this for you. Right in there, there's a dead body. That black thing's a dead body with handcuffs. Okay, let me sit, let me get where you're at. The dead body with handcuffs, right there. I don't see it. Right there, the black thing, the black figure. It's so dark. I'll move this. Way. There, see it? With the gray handcuffs there, see? Right there. The strange shape there is a dead body oh. with handcuffs. And then on the outer part, there's like a boarded area. Like the door is boarded. I put some plants there. And there's a guy that was scared in there. Then there's like some bones in a cauldron and it's flaming. I might imagine there's some liquid in there too. Like it's brewing a stew. Bone stew. The ghost is brewing bone stew. Oh, here's the signal light. Back to the trains. Signal light. These are the train tracks that I set for the surprise locomotive. Nice. Oh, and here is my train room logo entrance. This. An Amtrak looking train, the daylight, and a train I've had for a while. A red one. Three steam engines and a pose. On a this is a tricky track, a triple one. And That was all I had to say. So see you next time on another episode of Doggy Butt Trance Channel. Checkmate. Goodbye. <laughs>